Okay, now let us learn the valencies of ions so that we can write down the chemical equations properly using the proper chemical formulas of compounds. Let's learn the valency chart. We have divided the valency chart into groups and each group has the same valency. So in my first group, I have hydroxide, the polyatomic ion OH, fluoride, fluoride is nothing but fluorine which has become an ion. So fluoride, chloride, that is Cl, bromide, that is Br, bicarbonate, well we know carbonate is CO3 and bicarbonate is HCO3 which is also called hydrogen carbonate. This is an ion, polyatomic ion. Then we have nitrate, again in nitrate NITR stands for nitrogen and O stands for and H stands for oxygen. So nitrate is NO3. The entire group has valency 1. In this case it is minus 1 because all of them accept electrons to be stable. Now how do we learn that the entire group has valency 1 and the members of the group? Well there is a tune of the poem Mary had a little lamb and we are going to sing this group in a similar manner so that we can learn the valency. The song goes like this. Hydroxide, fluoride, chlorobromide, 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 hydroxide, fluoride, chlorobromide, bicarbonate, nitrate. Their valency is 1. So sing with me again. Hydroxide, fluoride, chlorobromide, 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 hydroxide, fluoride, chlorobromide, bicarbonate, nitrate. Their valency is 1. Now let's come to the second group. The second group has ammonium, the polyatomic ion NH4. Next is silver. Silver is Ag. Next, hydrogen H. Then potassium K and sodium Na. Now this group has valency plus 1. So we shall learn this group using the same tune. And the song goes like this. Ammonium a gaya hai ke nai, hai ke nai, hai ke nai. Ammonium a gaya hai ke nai, their valency is 1. Okay. Now let's go to the next group. The next group has magnesium. Mercury, Zinc, Calcium, Barium and Lead. The entire group has valency plus 2. So all of the members have valency plus 2. How are we going to remember this group now? The song goes like this. Magnesium hoga zinc ka bap, zinc ka bap, zinc ka bap. Magnesium hoga zinc ka bap, their valency is 2. Okay, isn't that funny? Now let's go ahead to the next group. The next group is oxygen, oxide, sulfide, that is sulfur S. Then we have carbonate, CO3. Then we have sulfate, SO4. This group has valency minus 2. And the song goes like this. O S CO3 SO4 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 O S CO3 SO4 their valency is 2. Okay, now let's come to copper. Copper's valency is 1 and 2. And let's come to iron. Even iron's valency is 2 and 3. So both copper and iron here have variable valencies. If we have to take copper's valency as 1, we have to mention that. And if we do not mention 1, we can just write the copper's name as cuprous. And if the valency of copper is 2, the name is cupric. Similarly with iron, if iron's valency is taken as 2, the name of the iron becomes ferrous. And if the valency is taken as 3, the name becomes ferric. And then the last one that we have is aluminium. So this group can be sung like this. 
copper 1 2 iron 2 3 iron 2 3 iron 2 3 copper 1 2 iron 2 3 aluminium 3 so this is how we learn the valency chart and i hope it is easy for you to remember the valencies now and form the formulas so get all the answers here so make sure you subscribe now